arrived in Doha, I'm going to pick up my bag which is the heaviest bag in history um, I don't know how the hell I managed to get on the flight but I did so um, yeah it must be about 35 kilograms maybe I think the bag was just 30 which is quite good in Qatar so yeah just heading to pick up my bag and then I'm going out to see my mum which I'm really looking forward to um, I haven't seen her since World Champs so yeah I'm excited to spend some time with family I'm here for the next three weeks Michael joins me next week, which will be really nice as well. So, um, yeah, unfortunately my camera stopped working, which is a pain in the arse, so I'm using this front camera. Um, so yeah, it's not as good, but it's tough. My other one's broke. Hello. So this is my mom's new dog. Which is a Saluki that they rescued. What are you up to? And it's probably the friendliest dog I think I've ever met in my life, but also the most energetic one. What are you doing now? Why are you biting me now all of a sudden? You've been nice all day. So where are we today? It's uh, Malta. So it's Christmas Eve, 24th of December, um, and we're going to go shopping. What are you going to buy? I don't know. Talkative as always, since the camera's on her, she's like a mouse. But um, yeah, with the model guitar is amazing, absolutely ma- AHHHHH! Talkative! Who's got a Is that you? I'm gonna be punched like! Oh, I'm an idiot. Hello, brother. Uh, so yeah, so we're gonna do a little bit of Christmas shopping, um, see what we can find. I have no idea what I want really, but um, yeah, I'm excited. Sure I'll find it. This place is massive, brand new, it's a state of the art mall. Oh, so yeah, really looking forward to seeing what we can find. Getting something new. Yeah. Hello, how are you? Hello, how are you? Yeah, really looking forward to getting something new. finished a long run this morning in the park at Spire. So it's Christmas day but um, I swapped my training days around so that I could have yeah a sort of evening off relaxing with family. So us two idiots, this one my brother, and uh, we decided to get up this morning and meet the rest of my mum's training group actually. So there wasn't just us a family of loons, there was actually quite a few families this morning and all met at the Aspire Park in Doha. Um, some of them actually, they actually did a hill session as well, which is even crazier. I had a long 12 mile run, um, but I'm very, very, I spent about 11 miles wishing it to be over. So yeah, I'm very, very glad it's done now. We're just waiting on my mum and John, here they come with our nice little smoothies. Um, These bad boys. They've changed the things. It's which literally mango and key lime, so is worth every it. single mile just to get one of these. There you go. So yeah, wishing everyone a Merry Merry Christmas and mm. Happy New Year. that long but um, I'm looking forward to getting a bit of a session in today actually get my legs moving. Um, a bit tired from travel it's always the same and also obviously it's really hot here as well so legs are a little bit battered but um, I'm gonna head to the treadmill this morning I'm gonna do a three mile tempo on there. I like doing it on the treadmill actually I feel like it allows me to keep I suppose a set pace. Um, outside 
it's a bit more of a struggle to get the legs going, get the turnover, um, especially when it's so hot. And, and in Qatar as well, there's not many places to run um, that are, I suppose, quiet. The Spire Park's brilliant for running, for easy runs and stuff, but it's very, very busy. Um, you're sort of running in and out and dodging kids on paddle boards and skateboards and bikes and all sorts of yeah it's a little bit chaotic so it's much easier for me to go on the treadmill get a consistent three mile pace um, I know a lot of people don't like the treadmill loads of athletes hate the treadmill but it's something I've always done um, my mum always did it and so I suppose I've just been forced into into doing it as well um, as my coach says I just do so yeah first up is three mile on the treadmill and then I'm actually going to head to the track and do my first little bit of speed work since the summer so I'm a little bit scared um, as to how that will go. I have a couple of 300s, the first time I wear spikes as well since the World Championships so um, yeah I think my calves will be a little bit battered in the morning but I'm excited and looking forward to getting in a little bit more quality um, ahead of, of the indoors. This is the sort of first, first real dip into some speed work so yeah looking forward to it.
crew. Dance crew. <laughs> So that's the end of this vlog and I just want to wish everyone a happy new year. Um, it's been really nice to spend some time with my family in Qatar. Um, I've got another couple of weeks out here. I'll do a race and then head out to Kenya. So it's going to be a pretty hectic couple of weeks. Um, but yeah, it's been amazing. 2017, I actually don't want it to end. It's been such a brilliant year. I've really, really enjoyed. And yeah, I've set a whole load of PBs this year. So I'm really looking forward to what 2018 has in store. I watch them grow.